I'm doing this. Oh, another metal slime. I'm gonna fight every metal slime because I want that drop. I also didn't- I, I should have wrote down the ingredients we needed from each monster. But I didn't. Because of, um, because I just didn't have the time. I should have wrote down every ingredient we needed. But again, if we don't get the monster, every monster drop rate, it's fine. I just want the battle records done, excluding the weapons. Ooh, is that the drop rate I need? Molten globules. Maybe. It was gold, or maybe I already have those. Please. It was, yes. All right, we're done with metal slimes. Perfect. Actually, this works out. Playing on Thursday is a good idea because we can get the monster drop rates out of the way. It doesn't apply to accessories, but it, apply it applies to ingredients, which I may or may not have. Like, I may or may not have gotten a drop rate from a certain monster. So, it does help. If it turns out to be an ingredient, it helps. I'm not going to use my coup de gras. I'd rather kill you normally. Oh, oh sexy beam slowed you down. Get him, Jessica. Come on. Uh, you're dead, I said? Yeah, there we go. That's what I thought. Alluring? Please. It's probably gotta be gold. I would assume that there's a gold, which is the rare drop, and the allure ring is probably the rare drop. You know what? Do that. So I would assume the gold one is the rare one. So we got the common drop from the hijinks. I'm assuming that's how it works. So apparently the molten globules we got from Metal Slime was the rare drop, it seems. Come on. There we go. Magic blast. Ba, 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 ba. All right, what what you got? Now it's nothing. Keep doing this. I'm getting this lure ring. I will get it if it's the last thing I do. We only need two more accessories, so I really want to focus on getting the accessories done. Because, like... Like, I want to get the accessories done because we only need two more. I really can't. I just want this allure ring. I mean, of course I would say that, but still, I fought like eight of these things. All right, goodbye. I hope you're ready for this. All right, that killed you. Iron nails. I don't need iron nails or royal soil. I need my allure ring. Game, please, why do you hate me? After singing, your, after singing your praises for so long, I would think that you would learn to like me. Give Elena the oomph. No pun intended. Go down. Go down. Spin. Come on, Elena. There we go. Please give me it. That's not gold, so I, I knew it wasn't it, and I asked anyway. Here we go again. I could do this all day. Alright, I'm not going to care about that metal slime anymore, because I got the drop. Oh, Angelo had pearly gates, right? I can literally do this all day. Oh, 
By the way, when I say we can get the battle records done, <laughs> it depends on how nice the drop rates are, or RNG is. So I really can't predict getting it done. But as I said, if I if I don't get it done, the rest of the playthrough is going to be recorded. Let me show you how it's it's going to be pre-recorded instead of stream. Much, much, much would rather do this than try to A-rank treasure hunting stages like Mad Space, Meteor Herd, in Sonic Adventure 2. I love Sonic Adventure 2. I love the game. But I would much rather do what I'm doing now than, than um, try to A-rank treasure hunting stages. Mad Space is the first example. Zoom! Get the oomph. oomph. There we go. Shining shot. It's my turn. Ah. It's time to become serious. Might as well use these. Why not? Bomb way. Bomb way. Good thing for a multi fist. There we go. Damage, damage, damage. Will my ball of fire reach you? Him. Might not now because you moved. Oh, what if I got it with the ball? What if I got the second one with the great ball of fire? That would have been nice. Did not reach. I figured it wouldn't. Come on. Go, please. No? Okay. I feel like monster minion drop rates are going to be even more annoying. I mean, this is pretty, this is pretty annoying. Oh, I did not want to fight you. Night Aberrant, I do not have time for you. You will die in like 30 seconds. Like, I don't have time for this. All right, goodbye. Case in point, I killed you so quickly. Double freeze, double freeze. I'm just saying. Oh, they're double freeze. Easy. The lost leader is probably going to be even worse to try to get the champion choker from. Because, um... Lost leader, first of all, takes longer to kill. Second of all, it, um... A lot harder to find him than a hijinx. At least, at least with hijinks, we got a good spawn rate. Actually, it shouldn't be too hard to find Lost Leader. Killing him might take a while, though. Game, please. Oh, a minion. Oh, that was one of the minions I needed. All right, well. You know what? Two birds with one stone. Uh, all right, let me check that off my list. Let me take it off. Missing monster drops, missing minions. Oh, yeah, hijinks was one of the ones I uh, was missing. As well as low jinx. All right, well we got one. I mean, part of me knew high jinx we were missing, but it slipped my mind that we were missing a minion for it. All right, we got one drop. I forget that oomph boosts everybody's attack. So having Angelo here might actually be good for getting kills a little faster. Even a little faster is better than no boost at all. Windows 10, it's really not a good time for an update. Please stop it. Goodbye. Please. Yeah, I figured. Leave it to me. Not what I wanted. Whatever, do that. I can't wait a moment longer. Teresa, I can't wait a moment longer to finally get this allure ring. <laughs> I we decimated him with the oomph. The oomph with my um the oomph with my um High tension? Annihilate him. Game, why do you hate me so much? Zoom. 
Drop rates, why do you hate me? I'm so nice to this game. All I ask is for a single allure ring. Also, I guess that answers my question. Thursdays only applies to rare ingredients, probably. So I don't think monster minions are affected by it. I think rare ingredients, if it's not an ingredient, I don't think it applies to Thursday being a higher drop rate. Wait. No, that's a, that's a file of mana. A file of magic water. I actually thought that was it. It looked gold. Ooh, a fire spear. Do I have your marked monster? Oh, by the way, I'm also gonna... I do not, yeah. By the way, if I see a marked monster, I'm gonna look if I have it. If I, I'm gonna look if I have the marked monster, but I'm not, I'm not gonna like ignore them completely. I'll still try to get any marked monsters in my way. I'm just not gonna go out of my way to get all of them on screen. But if I see one, I will gladly get it. Oh wow, that was easy. I mean, you're a fire spirit. Of course it was. But yeah, if I see a marked monster, I'll see if I have it and I will definitely attempt to, attempt to get any on screen. I'm not going to go out of my way just to get all of them. Like that fire spirit. I saw it. I didn't have it. Might as well kill it. Because it would make my it would make the cleanup I'm doing off screen much easier. Alright, any other hijinks here? No, there's no more. Apparently, I've been killing fire spirits without even realizing it. I mean, they are, like, really small. Probably with Jessica's crackle. Hi. I'm gonna fight you. For, like, the 20th time. It probably hasn't been 20. It's been, like, probably 15, if anything. 15 is not that far from 20. <laughs> My accurate wasn't that bad. My, um, accurate? Educated guess wasn't that bad. Yeah, blow up. Imagine if this thing blew up like a bomb. That'd be pretty sick. I need this allure ring so badly. You have no idea. My battle record book is very sick. And it needs this allure ring to be happy again. Nope. More royal soil. Every time I say royal soil, I cringe. Hey, Teresa got level 72 from this. I will say, it's tedious, but killing all these hijinks is getting us some levels. It is leveling up, us up relatively fast. Faster than I, than I thought. Like, obviously, this is not an ideal grinding method, but, I mean, it is getting us a few levels, which I guess is nice. But still, I can level grind off screen. Plus, metal slimes exist. Also, quicksilver keys exist. And rose guardians exist. Nope. RNG hates me. Any game that's like to platinum or 100% that relies. I wanted hijinks. Do I have that? Guys, I killed so many hijinks that I did- I got the wanted version. Oh yeah, well, I mean... I think wanted monsters give you more, uh, drops. I think they're better for drop rates. So, you know what? We're gonna just, uh... Pretty sure that wanted monsters give you better drops. So, like, I mean, why not, right? So I like that I can see your health. Oh, your, your health's going down relatively fast. Faster than I thought it would. Oh, you killed me, huh? Please. Thank you, Jessica. Very proud. Freeze! Oh, wow, you're almost dead already. This was a really short wanted monster. I fought so many of these, I got the wanted monster to proc. Honestly, I'm gonna be real with you, rather save my coup de gras for like a quick kill on another one. 
I don't think I need it. I think at this point, I might as well kill you normally. Please. Please! Oh. I can't believe I've been doing this for like 30 minutes. I mean, part of me can believe it, but also like, like, wow. This time could have been better spent. Chat, this would be a great, this is a great stream to AMA. Like, this is the best AMA stream. You have no idea. This is possibly the best AMA. Because I'm gonna be killing a lot of stuff, and it's gonna get very boring if I don't get the required accessory or ingredient I need. Not ingredient, um, drop or whatever. Or minion. Insert your drop here. Tells us Symphonia versus Final Fantasy X. Probably Symphonia. I don't know, honestly. I think FF10? Hard to say. Or maybe even Tide, to be honest. I'm gonna be real with you, I love Final Fantasy X. I think FF10 does its plot really good. It's really well done. Symphonia's plot is no slouch either, though. Symphonia also has a great plot. I think I'm, I think I'm slightly a fan of Final Fantasy X. Combat, though, combat, I like Symphonia more because I don't hate FF10, but I have my problems with the Sphere Grid. I know a lot of people love the Sphere Grid, and I'm not saying it's a bad level up mechanic, but it's a bit overrated. If you were saying 10-2 or Symphonia, I'd definitely vote 10-2 in the combat department. But, Sympho we're not talking about 10-2, but Symphonia would beat 10-2 in the plot department. But the combat department, I don't know. Symphonia, probably 10-2 would win. But, we're comparing 10 and Tales of, Tales of Symphonia and Final Fantasy 10. I think... Um, plot is pretty much tied. Both of them have very good plots, and I actually straight up can't choose. Combat is definitely Symphonia wins. Characters? Final Fantasy X. Probably, but Symphonia's characters are pretty good. Both very good games. Let me show you how it's done. I really like Final Fantasy X. I didn't really like Final Fantasy X-2's change in tone. Yeah, a lot of people don't like Final Fantasy X-2. I'm in the minority. I don't... Final Fantasy X-2 has a fan base, but... I'm in the minority of people who likes X-2. A lot of people hate the fact that X-2 shifted from like a char... From like a... Serious tone game. And a pilgrimage to like a Charlie's Angels clone. I personally don't mind it. I'm not saying I'm a fan of the Charlie's Angels references, but I don't mind them too much. It doesn't bother me. In fact, I think 10-2 is like... I think 10-2 shifting to a positive tone complements the game. I love FF10, but sometimes I felt the game was too depressing. So I actually really like that 10-2 kind of took a more lighthearted tone. I feel like it really did the game's justice. You're probably in the minority that thinks that, but... I think FF10-2 taking a light-hearted tone, more light-hearted tone, works in its favor. Because that just develops Yuna as a character more, because Yuna, Yuna was just like, she was planning to, spoilers for FF10 by the way, but um, Yuna was planning on um, Yuna knew that she was gonna like, sacrifice herself at the end of the pilgrimage and that she, that was, she was essentially gonna die. However, in 10-2, 10-2 is basically about Yuna, like, just enjoying her life. So, yeah, it's a little simplistic, and it's... A lot of people don't... Wouldn't think that, but I... I know 10-2 has its over-the-top parts. Don't get me wrong. 10-2 is not perfect. By any means, 10-2 is not a perfect game. But I think it works in its favor that Yuna just, like, lets loose a little bit. Because she wasn't able to do that in Final Fantasy X. 
So I really like what 10-2 did. Could they have handled it a little better? Yeah. They probably could have handled it a little better. I really like what they did. 10-2 is like far from a bad, a bad game. It's a, it's a really good game. One of my favorite Final Fantasies. Alluring, finally! Oh, man. Yeah, 97%. We just need uh, one more. Oh, finally! We can bounce on out of here.